never will we go up. Wait a second, Isaiah 41 and 10. No, I got a smartphone, but it's not that real smart. So just bear with me one moment, okay? This, this scripture is just to encourage you. When I woke up this morning and I read this scripture, I said, you know what? Because of God, because the God kind of things that I have, I, I can apply Isaiah 41 and 10 to my life. And it reads as such. Fear not. That's why we don't have faith. We don't see it. But faith is the evidence of things not seen. You better preach, sir. But fear not, for I am with you. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you. I will help you. And I will approach you. Right, right hand. Yes, sir. That's what the right hand represents. Come on and help him. That's what the right hand represents. Come on and help him. Yes. As I leave with you, I just want to leave with you to have the God kind of faith. Seek God daily. Amen. Not once a day. That's right. That's how we need a day. Three times. Three, four times. That's the amount of times we need to be praying to God. Why? Because the more you pray, the more you grow. And the thing I like about God is God works in mysterious ways because He don't come when He wants to come. He comes when He needs to come. And when, it, when it's all over, and you look back, you say, boy, if God had come there, I want to get the results that I have now. So walk in faith and study Daniel because it will bless your life due to the faith that he had in God with his consistent prayer life. And the one thing I like about Daniel is I'll leave with you this. After Daniel proved to all the men in the Bible how his faithfulness to God and how God delivered him, they, his faith caused the people he was surrounded by to increase their faith. As you're at work, school, home, wherever you are, people should look at 